Hey, I'm Ryan Fowler here on Tide 99.1, Tide99.1.com as we wrap up another practice at the University of Alabama. Sunday and Monday was an off day. Today it was more energized, it was very intense. The, the coaches were really trying to pick those spirits up uh, very, very quick as we're 11 days away from Wisconsin. You know, when you look at the struggles of the quarterbacks and we've got some quarterback uh, footage, it's really hard to tell. I think we'll know more at the end of this practice than we do right now, but still the same rotation. You see some guys going in and out and it's really hard to tell because they're trying to disguise for that media viewing period, which you would expect them to do. But you know, you look at the running attack that Alabama's going to try to present with a defense uh, that's going to be solid. You know, you look at this Heisman Trophy from 2009. No, we probably don't have a Heisman Trophy winning back on this team or even a candidate, but the workload will be the same as when you go back to 2009 with Mark Ingram getting the number of opportunities. Not saying there's going to be a Heisman Trophy winner here, but he'll get the opportunities. Derrick Henry, Kenyon Drake, and Damian Harris will certainly get the opportunities to have a, a lot of touches because of the struggles of the quarterback. That's really the focus now as we are now past that camp stage focusing on Wisconsin, putting some of that game prep in. It's very important for Nick Saban to find a quarterback that he's going to try to lead or pick to go into Wisconsin coming up in 11 days. I'm Ryan Fowler reminding you to subscribe to the YouTube channel here on Tide 99.1. And for all the coverage, Tide99.1.com, water wall coverage of the Crimson Tide, and check out the game each weeknight starting at 6 p.m. here on Tide 99.1.